update. Well, we want to begin this half hour with a story that will hopefully get you up off the couch and moving. Physical inactivity has long been known as a source of poor health, but now research is showing that if you work at your desk a lot, you may be at risk for some serious forms of cancer. They call it sitting disease, where prolonged periods of sitting can be the catalyst and the cure, so you need to get up and moving. Thousands of Valley workers head to work every day, fire up their computers, and basically park themselves there for hours, as much as seven to nine hours a day, according to researchers. Now, analysis by the American Institute for Cancer Research shows that level of inactivity by simply sitting at one's desk may have led to as many as 90,000 new cancer cases. The American Cancer Society also looked at the data, and they too found that the more time people spend sitting, the higher their risk risk of dying early and subjects were also more at risk for breast and colon cancer. We know that our bodies weren't made to sit for 8, 12, 15 hours a day. Um, going back to our roots, we were made to run and jump and skip and um, do a lot of physical activity. Najla Kayyem, a fitness instructor for 10 years, says prevention is pretty simple. Get up and get moving throughout the day. Getting up and stretching is a really simple activity to do. Go for a walk, get a uh, breath of fresh air just to keep that heart rate and uh, your body moving around so that you're not sedentary. I started standing at the beginning of this year. Kylie Gadd found her own solution. She stands every day, all day long. I feel more active. I feel like less lethargic. It can be hard, you know, towards the end of a long and stressful day. There's health reasons at the basis, but, um, you know, I think what it sort of boils down to is it's just I tried it and I liked it and I'm sticking with it. Kudos to her. Well, new estimates show some pretty startling numbers. According to MSN, frequent sitting is responsible for 173,000 cases of cancer every year in the U.S. Of those cases, 49,000 of them are breast cancer, 43,000 colon cancer.